What's up, YouTube, and welcome to a first look of dwarves, glory, death, and loot. Um, checked out the demo of this a while back and absolutely loved it, so I'm excited to show off the game. Uh, this game is releasing into early access on August 17th, so coming right around the corner. If you enjoy what you see here, there is a demo available on the Steam page. The link is down in the description. Thank you for to the developers for hooking me up with the key. And with that, let's dive in. Right, create a new clan. We'll begin with a short tutorial. It's been a bit. So we're going to go Battle Axe. We got 500 coins we're starting out with, so we're going to recruit you. I can't recruit you. <laughs> All right, so we're going to attach. Really? None of you can have it. Okay, there. We put it on there. Um, I don't think you can carry a shield while you have a spear. Oh, you can. Okay, perfect. Alright, then we're gonna sell. Retire a dwarf, retire a dwarf, and say, okay, click above a dwarf on the XP bar. Okay, close. Back. Recruit you. A proper battle. Okay, now let's find a battle. Here we go. Alright. You guys are ready to go. Let's do this. All right, so doors will fight automatically. They'll use their ultimate when they have enough mana. You can launch over the battlefield by using the mouse wheel to switch between automatic and manual camera with right click. You can also adjust the battle speed with the arrow keys by clicking or by clicking speed. All right, so this is what I love. Like, so everything, you get them all set up and then it's just, yeah, it's fights. There is a permadeath mode that you can do as well. It'll give you three times as many gems. And that when a recruit dies, it is done. All right, so battle report required any loot will be shown here. And you can hover over your doors to see details on how they performed. They can level up. They can get stronger. It's pretty fun. Um, resume. I hit. Okay. I hit escape. That was a problem. All right. I think we're going to go another battle. So this is 100 bounty XP. Okay. Tour. The battle axe just does some damage. Executed. Oh, hell yeah. It's got that special power on there. Alright, you switch between automatic and manual camera. Yeah. Um, so we'll keep going. Ooh. So, new helmet. Let's grab that. Um, maybe we'll grab the Warblade here. Let's go check out our dwarves here. I am going to put that on you. And we're going to give you this sword. We're going to sell both of these. So, oh, we got skills that we can put joint, uh, skill point gems in, which will give, like, various boosts that will carry across all of your dwarves. So that's kind of cool. Um, lots of stuff that goes on in this game. But it's it's kind of... I'm not big into idle games, but this one, this one gets me. <laughs> Um, back. That's what I need to hit. I swear I keep hitting back and I keep going to the same spot. This is driving me insane. Menu. No. Entrance. There we go. <laughs> it's like, what is going on here? Okay, copper shoulders. We have 180 gold. Sure, why not? We can recruit another. I don't have enough gold for that. Um, you can go into the shop. You can also just outright buy stuff. So white flag, the bar is fully charged, you can retreat from battle, um, upgrade shop tier, you can significantly upgrade your chance to find better items. Interesting things we can do there. I am going to throw these shoulders on you. Love how, I love how everything just shows up on the, uh, your doors. Okay. Is this really the only battle we got? Can we get a better battle? Here we go. All right, to war. Nice. Um, what did I see? Oh, they've leveled up. Okay. That's what I saw. Uh, 
This is a decent battle here. Let's see if I can get any more. Ooh, divine staff. So I want that, and we're gonna have to save up for recruiting. So you can. I want to create a cleric. They end up being very necessary. Honestly, that other guy back there, these two are just carrying it. The guy with the spear, I could change him into a cleric right now. Can you wear this? No, you can't. Okay. And then maybe we'll... I don't have the money for another recruit. Ooh, Hammer of Wrath. One-handed knight, no ultimate. Hmm. 75, I'm going to take it, and then we will go... This is 220. This might kick our ass. I'm not sure here. So you got 2 to 10 damage of attack 1.2... Does that have an ultimate? Does have an ultimate? And that has an ultimate. So does that. Um, I think we're just gonna hold on to that gear then. To war. Come on. Nice. Ooh. New staff. I think he's already... Well, they all leveled up. That's awesome. Um, so let's go into our dwarves here. Is this any different? It's actually got a lower attack speed. I'm gonna sell that. Let's get rid of the recruit spear. We'll hold on to the golden shield for now. Let's look at potential recruits. So they do have different stats between them. Okay. Um, wizard staff. Ooh. Damn it. Okay, so apparently I'm making... I, I was like, I was supposed to be using this thing, but I'm like, wizard? <laughs> yes, please. I don't know if I can... Can I change order? Does that is that a thing? I guess we'll see. Yeah, kind of is. Okay. Nice. Okay. Ooh, night helmet. Grab you. Let's see how we do with this uh this one here. Okay. It does a fair amount. It helps with a fair amount of things. Um Yeah, we'll go there. Crute spear gone to work. Come on! This is one of those games I could I, I could play this all night. <laughs> it's just it's simple, but it's incredibly complex. Ooh, wizard hat will go really well with this dude right here. So that's awesome. We got that. Uh, let's go check out our dwarves here. Fix that for you. Actually, what did that do? So it didn't affect damage, and it gave us wisdom. It gave us intelligence and speed. And, um, that's good. Okay. Uh, sell you back. Actually, let's check out the halls. Skills do we have? We don't have anything. So, buy a point. How does one buy a point? It does not tell me. Okay. Damn it. I don't like how it does that. Okay. Night shoulders. Three hundred and thirty XP. Or I mean good bounty. Five XP. Um get those. I 
XP needed three. So the next battle, they will all level up. Okay. That's what, when this is gold up there, that's what that means. Okay, some more. Here we go. Dude, that guy's got a wicked sword, too. Ooh, did that thing shoot like a phoenix out? That's awesome. All right. Shop. I don't have enough money to buy this yet. What's my what's my gold at? 66. I think I'm going to wait, hold off on the shop, so we'll just keep going to war. Um, these can go on you. And to war we go. Come on, kill them all. There we go. Rurium's on a killing spree. Hell yeah. All right. Now I have enough to go into the shop and we can buy this upgrade here. Guess we'll... 245. He's 300. Just go into this. Okay, two more. I think the choir is when they are getting uh, healed. I think we had a fair amount of loot dropped there, too. No, two things. Okay, Divine Crown. That'll help a bunch with our uh, Gromlotrum, who's our priest. Okay, dwarves. Let's see here. Okay. So that. Um, steel helmet. Does this improve really for anybody? Lowers the attack speed. Doesn't do much for damage. Gives him more weight, but honestly, I think we're fine there. Maybe we'll just hold on to that for another player. Um, gold ore is free. Tome of Insight. Plus 10% battle XP gain. Gain plus 1 intelligence on level up. Minus 10% speed. 30 plus 30% plus 30 weight. Gain 1 strength on level up. Minus 5% speed. 15% weight. Earn 30 gold for each level the wearer has. Man. The battle XP might be the best one to go with. Oh, someone actually has to be carrying this. Um, okay, I guess we'll just put it there. Okay, let's go. Come on. Four kills, hell yeah. All right, with divine shoulders, that will be good for our priest. All right. Should we recruit another per Yeah, I guess we'll recruit another dwarf. And we'll make you a hammer dude. That was one-handed, so you can have that. And we will put this on you. Sell these. And I'm going to move you. Okay. Let's go to war. So he doesn't have an ultimate, though. So with the second we get a better hammer of some kind, we're going to need to upgrade him. Did I lose people? Or no, he just killed a bunch of people. Okay. Hit. Uh, copper helmet. Ooh. Ice resist. So it's special. Let's see if that... Ooh, that does increase some stuff for him. It increases attack speed just a little. Wait, was that any better? I'm confused. The attack speed going down should be in a positive, but here it's reflected as a negative. 
Is it? So it's just showing red because it's losing one, but I do lose a fair amount of other stuff. So I'm actually, I think, having the one on there is a is a net win. But what about with this? No, I don't think that fits him well. Okay. Battle axes. Alright, we'll go to war. Get him, get him, get him. We need, like, arrows. I need archers. I've yet to have seen that. Ooh, copper shoulders. Let's take you. Hammer, still no ultimate with that. I'm not seeing much variety on uh, the options there. Assassin's Razor... Seven hundred and thirty for now let's go to the shop. I guess we can check out what we got here. So that's five thousand. Items become available when the corresponding skill is unlocked in the skill tree. Okay. So how let's look at the skill tree. Gems I owned. Oh I have one. Okay. Priest knowledge. Increased healing. Strength to all the words, increased damage is nice. Although archers aim, we just don't have an archer yet. Alright, we'll put it in the warrior's vigor. Copper shoulders that'll increase. A fair amount. amount. Okay. Halls, entrance. Oh, damn it. Wrong button. Let's go with this and head to war. Hell yeah, you can go. That priest and that mage back there. So fucking helpful. He's intense. <laughs> okay. See, nothing in here was unlocked again, now. We've increased the shop tier, that's for a few times. Um, do we get any different? Whoa, ooh. Yeah, let's go check that. Plus one to damage. Quite a, quite a difference there. Steel helmet, it's the same. Okay. Was this knight helmet the same? Yep. Wait, did you get more from the speed gums down? And you know, Rorum, you're you're good with your speed. I'm not gonna take that away from you. Shields up, hammers high. I want it. I don't know why having intelligence on that would be of any benefit, but I'll check and see. Oh yeah, that's that's worth swapping out. Um, speed up because he needs more. Dwarven dual axe. Ooh, that could be interesting. And then what is up over here? Znath the Defiler. He's a priest. Ultimate healing rain. Ooh. Oh, we're doing this battle. Okay. 
let's swap this out. Is that more? No, that's less. So what we're gonna do is I will create, I'll, get, I'll recruit another dwarf that'll wield that. So if we're throwing stuff, maybe we want dexterity? Well, no, that increased my uh, attack speed, though. Yeah. All right, I think we're good there. We can put the copper shoulders on you. Let's do it. Oh no, Rurum died! Kill that fucking guy. Oh no! Dude keeps healing himself so much. Okay, we got him. Staff of Water. It's a Holy Staff of Priest. Ultimate Healing Rain. Hell yes. Okay. I don't know if those are going to be any better, but we will swap out of that. So the damage goes down, but our stamina, wisdom goes up, intelligence. We get an ultimate that's better than what we have. That Ultimate Healing Rain was doing some work. I think I need... More recruits. I'm just not sure how to outfit them. Ooh. Uh, we got another bounty like this. Okay. Um, Dwarven helmet. Weight goes down a lot, but everything else kind of goes up. Fuck it. I'll, I will set you off correctly. You can start out pretty strong. What are we going to give him, though, is the question. Maybe since we're finally starting to die, let's run with another priest. Staff of water for the new priest that we just brought on. Shop. Nope, nothing yet. Let's go dwarves, halls, skills. I have no skill point. I have no gems. Mana region. Could be good. Who is wearing one of these? He doesn't need the mana regen, though. Who does? But you got that hollow. See, I lose wisdom and intelligence. That's going to suck. We just hold on to it, I guess. We'll sell this. Come on. <laughs> Alright, that worked. 
another staff of water. And that one's not as fancy as I don't think. Yeah. I like going after these things. So that's that ultimate healing. Is that, I, want, I want one where it's a different character is like the, the unique. I should have bought that uh, Assassin's Blade. I want to get that and maybe we'll make an Assassin. We'll grab more of those. Yeah, we're not there yet, but... There's so much going on. <laughs> Sweet. All right, steel helmet. Who's got one that needs this? You're a lower level, so I'll give you that. Ooh, elite orc, ultimate blood seeker, or elite. Yeah, it's the same thing. Um. This is 890 experience. Let's go with that. Death to the Green Horde. I'm afraid I may have a bit off more than I can chew. Yep. Yep, I definitely did. Come on, come on. Oh, we did it. New hall unlocked. Forge. In the forge, you can upgrade items. Okay, so Ring of Restoration restores 3% of max HP and removes one arrow every two seconds. Speed and weight. Um, unique. Restores 50% health when falling below 25% health. Become drunk for 10 seconds. One use per battle gain plus one per permanent wisdom on use. Ooh, that, I like that. Life regen, we'll grab that. Um, dwarves. So we're going to put that on you. Become drunk. Let's put that on our... He's our most brutal. And the idea of being able to... Back, so let's go forge. So we can only upgrade... How do we... How does this work? So let's say I wanted to upgrade this. I don't understand. Uh, let's read the instructions, dumbass. <laughs> place any item on the anvil. Place three copies of the same item, including rarity, on the ingredient slots. Pay the hammer fee. Okay, so. I would need three of these. Dang it. I don't have repeats of anything here. Okay. Okay. And it's like not just a repeat, it's like right down to the rarity too. That sucks. Okay. Um entrance. Crit damage. What do you got on right now? Let's see. Crit damage four, and this one does crit damage five. Why doesn't it show me the extra little thing on there? Um, do I have to go in here? Yeah, I'd have to go in here. Okay, so it is just a little better. But now we got an extra one of those. So we'll, we will save that down below. Things on below are like what we're saving for, for that. Um, let's get a recruit. We're going to need to outfit you. Night helmet. Um, yep, yeah, going with that. Got an assassin now. Well, shit, now I got that thing. Oh, what's this? Banner of War. Supporter. 
Let's grab that too. <laughs> what did I put on him? As far as... Seven, eight... Ah! It's got mana regen, whereas this has crit chance. So we're going to stick with crit chance. Let's go. Come on. Bloodthirsty slain for Dormant Cloak. Three roll. I wanna see Ooh, we do own two gems, so we could bump that up, but honestly I think I'm gonna go with priest knowledge. Man, so every time you upgrade this, the point gem is going to cost more. <sighs> what are you? He's an archer. Perfect. Froze him. Who burp? Oh, he burped. He's he's drunk. <laughs> there we go. Do we get his nice a bow? We gonna make an archer now too. Okay. So I need two recruits. Want to be the supporter? Oh. Grab that. I haven't seen a blue item yet, so we'll take you. I need another recruit badly. We will take that and that. Okay, doors. Okay. All right, supporter, you are gonna come hang out in the back. Oh man. Um. There we go. We'll go with that there. Divine crown. We need to make an archer. I am going to put you probably here. So we're going to make this. This will probably be one of the last battles. Now, I do wonder... Ooh, got a, a fair amount of stuff in here. This will be a tough battle. Um, I wonder if there's any like major bosses or if it's just stuff like this where you get these unique enemies. Come on, come on. Give them hell. Nice! No one died either. Hell yeah, new hall unlocked formation. Adjust battle behavior and gain a bonus for bringing certain formations to battle. New formation unlocked ragtag. Ooh, we got a dragon staff. That's a fire staff for a mage. Avatar of fire. A new holy staff. And then a bastion shield. Ooh, shit. We got, a, got some cool shit out of that. All right. That's a cool looking shield too. All right, uh, you are gonna get yourself a new, well, yeah, yeah, no, you're gonna get a new one there. Um, is this staff of water new? No, it's not. I wish there was a better way to organize all this. 
I still haven't unlocked any of this stuff in here. I'm just gonna spend my money needlessly. I know I said I was gonna, but that was it, but I wanna do one more to see now what the new stuff. Okay. Maybe, I was hoping for another lovely card like that one we found just now. Costs money to re-roll, too. <laughs> it's a good thing I have a lot. Ooh. I don't know what that guy has, but let's check it out. Dude, these guys are calling down like thunderstorms and shit. Alright. Oh, hell yeah. We upgrade that to Shoulders of Wrath. Doors, Shoulders of Wrath. Holy shit. Wisdom goes up a ton. That just screams that's part of a mage. Um, Alright. Alright, one more. <laughs> I'm hooked. <laughs> Fuck. No, we got blue ones. We're, we already got better shoulders of wrath. Um, let's see. Give me a good battle. Over a thousand X uh, bounty. Helmet of Wrath. Oh, I'm buying that. And there was a bounty there that was well over what I needed. Ooh, a new Warhammer with an ultimate. That's awesome. It's like the game knows I want... I'm ready to stop. <laughs> oh, come on. Bow of Wrath. Oh, come on. Fine, we'll just take this one. Okay, so we got a little bit of outfitting to do. Um, not better, but... Really, that's not that much better, is it? No, that's kind of shitty. Um, intelligence goes down. Speed goes down a little on him. Weight goes down here. Okay, so we're going to put that on you. Um... Did I buy anything else? No, I guess not. I thought this was going to be better. It does have an ultimate, though. Oh, this has an ultimate now. Oh, it's because of the shield. I have an ultimate because of the shield. Okay, whatever. Let's go. This will be the final battle. I haven't even checked out what the formations thing looks like, so we'll look at that real quick and then we'll wrap up. Six. He's just, he's a fucking beast. Okay. Um, dwarves, halls, formation. Okay, so every dwarf will run as fast as he can. Dwarves that are too far away from the clan center will reduce their speed. The speed of each dwarf is capped by the dwarf in front of him. The speed adjustment will be applied once the start of the battle. This is ragtag. Have all seven base professions in your clan. Effect increases main attributes of all clan members by 15%. And I believe we do have one of everything on there, so that's cool. All right. Well, that is Dwarves, Glory, Death, and Loot. I'm hoping there's a bit more. I, I'm, you know, like I said, this is launching into early access. Let me take a look at this page here real quick, see if there's anything that talks about uh, development plans. Like, There's more skills we can do, so that, that adds a bunch. 
Okay, so although players can already jump in and enjoy commanding their Dwarf Legions, the game is still in demo phase. More new gear, professions, maps, and bosses are coming to heat up the battle even more. So that upon launch, I'm imagining we're going to see a lot more. And then probably even more stuff to be announced at a later date. So if you liked what you saw, there's a link in the description. Go check it out. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and go check out indie-gems.com. And until next time, take care.